who suffered horrific burns in a bonfire accident has spoken out against proposed cuts to North Yorkshire fire service. Lucy Morgan, who's 20, is concerned that reducing the number of firefighters could hinder response times for engines to get to emergencies. The fire service says it needs to make the changes, as Chris Kiddy reports. Eighteen months on from her ordeal, Lucy Morgan has joined the Fire Brigade's union campaign against major changes to the county's fire service. Lucy was left with burns to her face and body after paint thinners exploded on a bonfire. She's needed skin grafts to help the wounds heal. To become more efficient, North Yorkshire Fire Service wants to replace some fire engines, which currently have a crew of four, with smaller vehicles with a crew of two, or mixing crews with full and part-time firefighters together. If they're going to be sending out just two firefighters instead of the full team and cutting down the amazing fire engines, it could put people at risk, definitely. Lucy says in her case, a crew of two would not have been enough. When the fire service came, there were still things on fire. There was still, it was creeping into the garage where there was other flammables in there. So if they weren't there, then it could have happened to innocent bystanders next door, to the next door neighbour in gardens and everything like that. So we definitely needed their full team. These proposals will lead to either a longer response or... Lucy has narrated a video on a campaign website showing how fast fire can spread in the home. The fire service say the number of incidents they attend and the level of risk has fallen over the past 10 years and there's a need to deliver a more cost-effective service. That's not how the FBU see it. House fires and road traffic collisions in North Yorkshire have not reduced significantly, as have been stated. Um, some managers have pointed out this as much as 30 or 40 percent, which is not true. Um, and whilst we look at the um, risk profile that the fire cover review is all about, how can a risk in 2004 have changed to 2015? But a spokesman for the fire service said today, we believe that the proposals will mean there is still an effective fire and rescue service response, whereby the right number of highly trained staff with the right equipment will be sent in good time to emergencies of the type that Lucy was involved in. Our consultation is ongoing at this time and no decisions have been made. They're urging anyone with an interest to complete a feedback survey on the fire service website. Chris Kiddy, ITV News.